Hello, everyone. My name is Tithanka Lahiri, Senior Vice President of Data and In-Memory Technologies. My team is responsible for the Oracle database engine, including transactions, data formats, indexes, and Oracle database in-memory. And I'm Alparik Bahar, Intel Vice President and General Manager, Data Center Memory and Storage. Oracle and Intel have a unique collaboration model as we collaborate beyond typical server OEM engagements. We call it across the stack. We have a long-standing partnership in both hardware and software with deep co-engineering of both. The highly tuned and optimized Intel Silicon combined with Oracle's customized platform offerings such as Oracle Exadata have a compelling value to customers. As part of the collaboration with Intel that Alper mentioned, we have an ongoing and very successful initiative with Intel to maximize the performance of database in memory on Xeon processors. First, let me explain what database in memory is. It is a native built-in feature of the Oracle database available as an option to Oracle database enterprise edition that enables real-time analytics on any data source. Real-time analytics is essential in today's world for real-time enterprises. Oracle Database in Memory is therefore adopted globally across every industry, financial services, telecommunications, retail, manufacturing, etc. All of these industries need to act on insights gathered in real time against rapidly changing current data. For instance, evaluating a financial transaction for fraud before the transaction is allowed to proceed. It is based on a unique dual format architecture. In addition to the normal row format, database in-memory also creates an in-memory column format for tables that are selected for in-memory processing. The row format is optimized for transactions and the column format is highly optimized for analytics. The database automatically directs transactions to the row format and analytics to the column format. And database in memory is therefore completely transparent to the application. This in memory column format is highly optimized for analytics and supports analytic processing at the rate of billions of rows per second using SIMD vector processing instructions, such as Intel AVX instructions. Now, database in memory speeds up not just analytical workloads, it can also speed up transactions. In traditional databases, a table usually has a number of conventional indexes that support analytic queries. These indexes do speed up analytics, but they also slow down transactions since transactions now have to maintain these indexes as data changes. Since the in-memory column store replaces these conventional indexes, transactional workloads also run faster, having far fewer indexes to maintain. This is why this technology is central to Oracle's converged database architecture, since it allows super fast analytics as well as faster transactions against the same data. Thirthankar, that sounds great. How can you make it even better? Database in-memory is unique in that unlike other in-memory technologies, it does not require the whole database to fit in-memory and can be enabled at the table level or even at the sub-table or partition level. While it is not necessary to have everything be in-memory, more memory capacity also increases the performance advantage of database in-memory since then more tables can be stored in the column store. This is why we are very excited about Intel Optane DC Persistent Memory, a game changer in in-memory hardware that we believe will greatly accelerate the adoption of in-memory database technology. Optane DC provides a quantum leap in memory capacity well beyond Moore's law-driven growth in DRAM density. Alper, can you please tell us more about this amazing new technology? Yes, thank you, Thirthankar. Intel Optane DC Persistent Memory is a true technology enabler of in-memory databases. This revolutionary product, which launched earlier this year, is now shipping. It's the culmination of more than a decade of work at Intel. It places high-density persistent memory on the fast memory bus 
and enables vast memory capacity for the system. In memory mode, DRAM is used as a cache for the persistent memory and for lowest latency. And Optane persistent memory provides cost-effective capacity. Intel Optane DC persistent memory makes massive memory capacity both possible and cost-effective. This greater memory capacity is available today on any hardware that supports Optane DC persistent memory. Optane DC persistent memory with memory mode is supported seamlessly with database in memory, absolutely no changes required. We have seen 10 times performance gains over a pure DRAM based system due to the increased memory capacity. So what's next for database in memory and obtain DC persistent memory? Additional enhancements to database in memory in 20C, such as vectorized joins, increases the performance advantage to 40 times. We also have ongoing development to leverage the persistence capabilities of Intel Optane DC in app direct mode and support instant restart of the column store. We are therefore very excited by the combination of our class leading in memory technology and the most significant innovation in memory hardware in decades. Thank you so much for inviting me to talk about this amazing technology. This has been another great example of the benefits of the deep technology collaboration between Oracle and Intel.